Hey, Jessica, well, one major way was the fact that although Kendra Horn led all night and really overwhelmingly led in the early vote, Stephanie Bice won the election day vote. Hey, Oklahoma, we did it. <laughs> Elation at the Republican watch party last night as the results rolled in. And this morning, Congresswoman-elect Stephanie Bice, all smiles on the KOCO morning show. I am thrilled. Uh, it was a great uh, victory. That victory because she improved on former Congressman Steve Russell's margins when he lost in 2018. Bice won the rural counties by 41 points compared to Russell's 24 and only lost Oklahoma County by less than a point. Russell lost it by four and a half points. The 2018 election was a surprise. Uh, we lost this congressional seat by 3,300 votes, an incredibly small margin out of 240,000 cast. And um, I think that people wanted to see you know, Republican values return to the seat. That comes after Democrats flipped this seat two years ago for the first time in four decades. Last night, Horn conceding, but saying the fight continues. So take a deep breath and get a little rest and let's get started again. But we're all working towards, in many ways, a common goal, and that's uh, the, the better of our states, the, uh, the better of the country, and uh, really find things that we can agree on. And not only had Democrats hoped to hold on to that congressional seat, they had also hoped to flip Oklahoma County blue, have it vote for a Democrat. That did not happen. They'd also hope to flip some county level seats like court clerk, county clerk, sheriff, even a commissioner seat. None of that happened last night. Republicans maintained control in Oklahoma City. Dylan Richards, KOCO 5 News.